Okay guys, so in this video I will teach you how you can make around ten to thirty thousand dollars every single month. Super simple, basically just by consulting business owners. And you might say that you cannot do this because you know you don't have a skill set or stuff like that, but just listen to me now. You want to make around ten K to twenty K a month, not of doing drop shipping, which I usually teach, not of selling courses, none of that weird stuff. Just consult business owners on their marketing. It could be on anything else too. It doesn't have to be marketing. But what I do, I make around twenty K a month just by consulting owners. You know, I consult some brands, just tell them like, yo, you have this Facebook ads It's doing kind of pro it's pretty profitable, but you want to increase the profits. Well, just do what I'm doing. So I'm going to show you guys some numbers here real quick. So you guys realize that I'm not capping. Don't use that word. That word was, was really ugly, but I started consulting business owners and I'm showing you guys here in a sec. I started consulting business owners around half a year ago and the business has been making a good amount of money. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm going to try to show you guys right here. So it's been making me a steady like 15k a month. I also get some money off of PayPal because not everyone is willing to pay an invoice. But usually what I will do is I would just go in Facebook groups and talk to people. Now though, I get a lot of these guys just coming to me and I get referred by a lot of brands. So now the whole process is kind of automated. I could get clients while I'm just sleeping or just getting messages on, for example, Facebook or people saying like, yo, can you do this for me? Because I used to be so active because I'm kind of growing in the community. So people are starting to realize who I am. But how I started out doing this business was just me helping out people in groups. I would just go into Facebook groups, you know, and I'll talk to people and they would say like, yo, my marketing isn't really working out and this is exactly what you guys should do, right? So they will say like, yo, the marketing isn't really working out. If you don't know about Facebook ads, you don't know anything about it, I'll probably say some weird stuff now, but just, you know, look at a bigger picture. Right? So if you say my marketing isn't working and there is something on Facebook ads that's called expand detail targeting, st start typing in comments like, yo, try to check on the expand detail targeting. Try to just split test that button and try to see if that works and just tell them to try different scenarios and they'll be like, yo, thank you, man. And you'll just say like, oh, no problem. Message me if you need anything. And what happens? This guy's message you. So it's all about being active places and just helping out people. Eventually, once you help out people, they're going to come back to you and people are going to realize, yo, this guy in the comments know what he's talking about. Let's send him a message. And then eventually, if you just answer questions on Facebook groups, you know, marketing groups or whatever, if you answer questions there every single day, you're going to start making a lot of money by just potential clients. So what you guys should do with these clients is you should obviously set up a meeting with them. Let's just say you talk with a client like once a week, you get in some consulting and always give them, you know, some tasks they can do in the meantime and just give out the blue print or just say like, yo, I sell four hours for, you know, $500, just capture the money. And you could do it like a monthly thing, but this is all about consulting business owners, consulting them about the marketing, teaching them how they could make way more money when it comes to their marketing. And you could also do this business on LinkedIn. You could go to a lot of people on LinkedIn, just connect with them and just ask them questions about their marketing. Basically you're being the spammer. You guys probably seen email marketers spam your Instagram all the time, but you're being the spammer, but you need to spam in an appropriate way, right? You cannot spam about something super generic like, yo, I'll run your Facebook ads. Everyone does that. That's why I think the consulting business owners is a good business because they usually don't get spam when it comes to consulting. And you need to tell these guys like, yo, you know how much money you're leaving on the table every single month? Let me show you how you can stop doing that. And this is how I started my business as well. I used to do the Facebook thing. Another thing that I would do would I would just pick up my phone I would find a profile on Instagram and I would just, you know, click the record button, fill myself and look at this guys. This is exactly what I would do. So let's just say here we have like 24 hour fitness. It's a company. They sell gym clothing. I would just do this. Yo, what's going on? This is Henrik from Norway. So I checked out your website and I can see that you're leaving a lot of money on the table every single month. This is good. This is bad. But do you want to know how I can make you around ten to $40,000 more every single month? If you're interested about that, let's get on a quick call. We could change this on your website. I can kind of see this is not clear to the customer. You're probably leaving a lot of money by not having upsells. There are a lot of things that we can do. If you're interested, just send me a message. There you guys saw it. That was me live doing this. It was obviously staged. But that is what you guys can do. Consult business owners, but don't be around here lying. You need to have some skills. You need to know what you're doing because if you're just going to go around lying, a real business owner will realize that straight away because these guys get spam all the time. And also guys, I would I would consider doing this. So work for them for some testimonials. And this is where most people click off the video, right? Because they don't want to work for testimonials. They want to get the money straight away. But listen, if you have good testimonials, that then it's going to help you way more because then you could do this 
this video, yo, it's me, Henrik from Nova. I just want to show you exactly, look at this screenshot, exactly how I took this client of mine from $10,000 to $50,000 in a month. If you want me to do the same for you, just send me a message. So you can send out messages like that. You could also post in Facebook groups like, yo, I did this for a client earlier. It was a brand. He wanted to, you know, do something with his marketing, getting more clients to his dental clinic. It could be whatever. So th and you just make case studies in Facebook groups, right? You talk about advice. You post a long post in a Facebook group of like how you took this client to this and that. You're not selling anything, just posting tips. Just guess, guess what, guys? When you wake up, your inbox is going to be spammed. And this is probably the easiest way for you to make a lot of money as a young guy because you can literally start off without any money, just have the skills. And you don't need perfect skills, but make sure you're pretty good at what you're doing, right? If you're offering Google ads, be good at it. And I've seen the same thing started happening with Instagram. I get a lot of people hitting me up now saying like, yo, check out how I can get your Instagram from a thousand followers to 5,000 to 50,000. My Instagram is here, by the way. Want to hit a follow on it? Um, for me, it's whatever. Make sure to like the video and subscribe though. But I get a lot of those messages all the time. And listen, the first time I got this message, I told this guy when I was on a call with him, yo, I always ignore the spam, but your outreach was so good that I, I did a call with you. And I almost joined it for real. And I know all the sales tactics, right? But this guy was so good at his outreach that I was like, yo, let's give this man a chance. So that's the business, guys. It really is simple. Just like, you know, learn a skill and consult owners on it. And you don't have to consult a meter. You could do, you could automate it. You could run ads for other people, get into SMMA, social media marketing agency. You could do whatever, but this is how I make 20K every single month. I mean, it could be 15 sometimes too. It could be 30, but this is not my main business though. My main business is drop shipping. I run up my own uh, general stores for drop dropshipping, run Facebook ads to a product. If you don't know what dropshipping is, you can check out my second channel in the description. It's actually my main channel, teach you guys how to dropship. So my different income sources, and this is not really related to, you know, the video, but my main income source is dropshipping. My second income source, the biggest after dropshipping is dropshipping for other people, running ads for other stores. My third one is actually this consulting business owners. And my fourth one is coaching people on how to make money with dropshipping. I don't make too much there, but these are my four income sources. I also sell a course, but the course isn't selling to anyone. So, you know, that's not an income source if it doesn't sell too well. Yeah, so that that is all my income sources. When I was younger, I used to do income sources such as, you know, designing logos for people. I would do that all the time. But those are my income sources. But listen up, guys. Once you start getting credibility, you start getting testimonials, start getting results that you can show clients. Dude, that is the thing. If you want clients, you need to show results. But let's just say I want to get into dropshipping. But you realize that dropshipping, you know, you need a big budget to get into it. Let's just say like you need $5,000 to get into dropshipping. I'm not saying you need that. But let's say that's what you need to enter that business, which you really want to enter. Well, how are you going to get your money? You need to do something else. But if you're good at Facebook ads, you could just do this for other people, right? You could consult business owners. I think Ty Lopez was talking about this business earlier of how, how you can make money consulting business owners. I'm not sure, but consulting business owners is probably one of the best places because it's probably one of the best businesses because every business owner has money. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to read up what I just saw here. And this is not me coaching my dropshipping uh, students. This has nothing to do with this. It's about consulting business owners, something completely different. But I'm going to read up this thing on screen here. According to Forbes, the consulting industry is worth a whopping hundred billion dollars per year. That is a lot of dollars. And you could definitely get a million of that, right? And it's predicted to grow 80% every single year over the next five years. There's never been a worse time to be an employee and there's never been a better time to start your own consulting business. I couldn't read that properly. But listen up, guys. Everyone has a business, or not everyone, but everyone you're targeting has a business. And most businesses have money left over unless you're consulting a teenager who wants to get into dropshipping but doesn't have too much money. Nothing wrong about that, of course. But the first step to building a successful consulting business is number one, pick your topic. Is it going to be Facebook ads? Is it going to be consulting people on graphic design? It could be whatever. It could be consulting people on how to release a PayPal hold. Like that's a good business. Listen to this, boys. Like I'll have a lot of people that has holes in their PayPal. And my friend Harry does this, right? right? Let's say someone has $100,000 locked in PayPal. He knows how to release hold. He knows how to release money and hold. So if someone has 100K locked, he say, yo, give me 2K and I'll release all your money. Who's not gonna do that? Because PayPal is not releasing it, right? So every time he hits someone up, like I'll release your money, just give me 2% of it. Well, he just made 2K of releasing someone's 100K. So there's so many businesses out there. But that's number one, figure out what you want to consult on. Number two, master your pitch. You need to have the best outreach and you can't be looking like everyone else. And don't cold call, it's probably not gonna work. Number three, learn from someone else. Learn from someone that knows this better than you.
number four, start a little bit low. Just seriously, just start selling it for a hundred dollars. Once someone pays you a hundred, sell it for two hundred. Someone pays you two hundred, sell it for four hundred, five hundred, a thousand, and it just goes up. And also, guys, one thing you really should do is you should take the money you're making and put it into ads. So if you make a thousand dollars of a client, put four hundred of it into ads and show like and make you know case studies on Facebook ads. Like just put an ad in people's face, like yo, do you want to see what I did for this client? If you're a dental company, like just say like this, yo. I see that you're a teeth whitening guy and you have a dental company, you fix people's teeth, you make them whiter. Well, I just took this client of mine to, you know, I'm almost out of business to a whole nother level because I consulted them on how to run these ads, right? This is my second channel. I'm honestly just going on rants on whatever I feel like talking about and I just want to pinch all the ideas I can. But this is how I make 20K a month as I prove, as I've proven to you guys earlier. It's not a crazy business. I'm probably going to stop doing it eventually because consulting is kind of time drain so it's not worth it for me at this point but it's been a super cool business i'm gonna stay on it for a couple of more months maybe i'll end it this month i'm not sure yet but super good business to really get in touch with money online so i recommend you guys to get in it and you know if you didn't like the video please should stay anyways because i post everything that's on my mind on this channel and i'm not taking it too serious this channel is just for fun and it makes a lot of happiness and purpose for me to just post whatever i want right so i hope you guys like this uh, next video i hit you guys with some real motivation because i know you guys want to be motivated so i'm be here for the next video to inspire you guys to take it to the next level because i know everyone watching this can achieve all their goals because i was like a loser a couple of years back and um, that's it guys just subscribe and like appreciate you